Yes. Okay, we are. Cool. So we're back again playing some more Shadows of War. We made some great progress the last couple times. I should probably turn my audio off. Can't be making uh, silly first-timer mistakes like that. Not when I'm officially partnered now. It's true. It's true, it's true. I'm officially partnered now with Twitch. Feels great. Feels like a lot of my work is paying off. I have you all out there to thank for watching me uh, all this time. And I'm going to try and continue to entertain, like, tonight. And uh, I guess we're just starting out now. We'll wait for the room to fill up a little bit. And then we'll see what quest line we want to continue with. I didn't even realize that these were all different quest lines that I could continue from. Ah, uh, hello, Mr. Giggles. Hello, Red. Welcome, welcome. You're the first ones joining us tonight on this, my very first Twitch partnered stream. As I was saying, I have all of you in the chat to thank for this, uh, your continued patronage. You're just showing up when I decide to do these because I do these, you know, very randomly. I appreciate it, and I'm going to try to continue entertaining you and continue not fucking it up. Hmm. Thank you, thank you. And because you two are the first in the room, you get to decide what series of side quests we're going to be tackling tonight, because I realize there's a couple. There is the uh, Ethereal quest. I think this is the continuing uh, tracking down of the Nazgul. Uh, I have to defend one of my fortresses from them. I can do the Bruise quest line, which I'm actually surprised I haven't done the Bruise quest line yet. It seems like I opened this up early on, but didn't do it. Uh, siege missions, <laughs> I've conquered pretty much everything. Yeah, I've conquered all the ones that are to conquer, except for the storyline ones. Uh, the nemesis missions, which, oh, okay, these are just like online nemesis ones I can do. Ooh, but it tells us what tribe there is, and what cool loots I could possibly get. I've barely done any of the Shadow of the Past missions. That's where you can become, uh, Calibrimbor for a little bit. Haven't done any of the webs of fate yet. I haven't really enjoyed those. I did the door ones. You get cool elven gear when you complete those. The only problem is, is that they scale to your level at the time. And because I did the first one early on, the armor's weak. Not a fan of that. Gondorian artifacts. Okay, and these are challenges. You know what? I think I'm going to do the bruise one because he's just a fun character. And I'm surprised I haven't done this one yet. This also means we get to see our first fort defense. You guys have seen me take a fort. You haven't seen me defend one yet. This will be interesting. I also think this is a storyline that I can play for a couple hours and actually finish up tonight, which is what I will attempt to do. That's my mission I'm setting for myself. Also, how do you guys all like the camera tonight? I tilted it up a little bit. You can actually see me slightly better. I'm filling the box more. Either that or I'm just getting fatter. I don't know. Could be either. Is that time of year? All right, bruise it is then. We're all in agreement. That's good. All right. Oh, wow, that's a long way away. Tell you what, I'm going to summon my Karagor. So I don't have to just trudge all the way there. Out of my way. I'm a man on a mission, damn it. I'm a big, important man. Well, technically, I'm only half man. There's some ghost in there, too. And that ghost was an elf when he's alive. So does that make him full elf or full ghost? Oh. I'm trying. Now, see, this is a random thing that triggered just because I happened to be on a Karagor, and this guy has a boner with Karagors, clearly. But that's alright, I, I, I ain't afraid of him. I ain't afraid of no dudes. In fact, he gets to be the first victim of tonight, Karagor dude. Oh, God damn it! Oh, no, he's killing my Karagor! Well, maybe, maybe I did bite off a little bit more than I could chew here. Maybe I was wrong. That's fine, I will turn your Karagors against you. Which you will then thusly kill, because you clearly have some special thing on you. That you're an expert at killing Karagors. Oh no, oh no, oh no, 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 no. Yeah, Karagor killed me. 
I would like to state for the record, the Karagor killed me there, the guy did not. I still keep that victory, cause, cause, cause technically he did it. That's fine, I don't, I don't even care. I don't even care. Also, that guy who works for me succeeded, so that's good. Oh, I can't let this go, though. I just can't. I need my revenge. I'm terribly, terribly petty like this. Also, he seems to be dueling one of my guys wherever he is. So that's okay. I cannot let this indignity to me pass. We will do story mission, but I gotta kill this guy first. To get my honor back and the honor of the stream. And speaking of uh, honor of the stream, you can now actually tip me officially now. Obviously, there's still all the PayPal links. You can still tip me for free via Gokbox if you have a mobile device or if you're willing to watch an ad or anything. That's all still good, but now you can uh, tip me and subscribe the official Twitch way now. That's a thing. Also, there's bits. There's something about bits. I never understood bits. I never used bits. I never thought I would have to understand bits. But if you like bits, that's a thing now. I also have an Amazon gear thing now. Which, again, I also didn't really understand how Amazon gear worked. So I just filled it with things I liked. And maybe you'll like them too. I think the deal is if you buy via that, down in the description, I get a small percentage. All I know is that becoming Twitch partnered, they made me frickin' sign a ton of tax stuff. Like, I thought one of the joys of working online is I would never have to fill out so much paperwork, but they're like, nah, nah, fill out all the paperwork. And now we play hot, cold, hot, cold with this guy to see where the hell he is. He's somewhere in the area, but we don't know where. Oh, there he is. Hosh Grish, and he's riding a Karagor. Oh, there seems to be a lot of fun implements of death around here, too. Some fireplaces, some other fun stuff that I can get him trapped into if need be. And in fact, I'm sure I will. Hey, hey you. I, I knocked you off your beast, idiot. Now I'm gonna kill your beasts. I didn't run away, I died, but you know. By all means, feel f feel free to retcon. There, ice and fire all together. There we go. Shot you to death. There. Oh shit, he actually Oh, cuz he uh cuz I died the first time he actually dropped uh, some rather good gear, I do believe. Screw you, Karagor. Screw you a hundred times and a hundred times more. And you... I hate you. I hate you all so much. Words do not describe how much I hate you, Karagors. You are, you are worse than any enemy, and fighting five of you is tougher than any boss fight. I really... Oh, God, now you want a piece? Oh, Metal Beater. Great, a betrayal. Nice. I guess that guy I just killed was Metal Beater's blood brother. Who'd have thunk it? Certainly not me. Yeah, I'm gonna get off. Uh, and he's part of the Machine Tribe, which means he's fireproof. Oh, and he's a Vault Breaker. You know, just to really make it difficult. Hmm. 
And now just everyone is coming to ruin my day. At least I killed him in one go. I cannot handle traitors. So I got I, I gotta kill him, I just gotta. I had stuff to do, but he, he needs to die. It's the only way. No, yes more, you don't run from me. No one runs from Talion, you betraying dickbag. Oh shit, he's... For a big guy, he's fast. Wow, he's really fast for a big guy. Look at him run. He's running and he's dropping bombs everywhere he goes. No, 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 no. Nobody escapes me. I will catch you wherever you run. It's a thing of mine. I must have my revenge. Also, hello, whoever just joined the chat. I see the number thing went up. I would say hello. But I'm trying to chase down a dirty betrayer. Yeah. Uh, apparently that's not good enough to hit him. Must have revenge. I will follow you to the ends of the earth. Oh good, the Karagor got him. Oh, not good enough, apparently. Finish him next time, Karagor. There we go. Stop running. Again, it's moments like this where I wish the targeting was better. Oh good, ghouls get him. Let's finish this. You're just going to kill me. Yes. I mean, if you're into that kind of thing, I'm sure I could get one of the other orcs to torture you on my behalf. All right, there we go. We killed the cheap shotter. We killed the traitor. Now let's actually get to what we were supposed to do. I have nothing else. I got some fairly decent gear. I'm not upset with uh, getting some good gear. Now, where the hell was I actually going? Oh, let's check and see what items we got yet, if they're better or worse than what we're currently carrying. Better or worse? Ooh, much better, actually. All right. Terrorize a couple enemies, and I actually make that one stronger. Better or worse than what I got? Yeah, worse. Also doesn't look as cool as the terror armor. I mean, freaking just look at that. Look at that sweet-ass terror armor. Where the where the hell was I going? Where where was my actual mission here? Okay, my mission was right over here. The best defense, which actually teaches you about defending, uh, about defending your fort. I I never had to do it because I just kind of left the area, so I haven't had to do any of the defenses yet. All right, but how as that loads? How's the chat doing? Oh, is uh, Caitlyn gonna stream tonight? Yeah, I know she's pretty good about that too. So. will fight us for every. Yeah, hello, Tommy. Welcome. I didn't welcome you officially, and you're not that late to the stream. You're never too late for a Joel stream. I like to think I I take a bit to get warmed up to really get going. Ooh, I should uh, terrorize some enemies on my way there, as to make uh, my new bow better. That is a cool thing that every uh, piece of new gear and weapons you pick up, you can augment and make better just by doing little in-world tasks. That's really cool. That's a good idea. I wish more games would do that. <laughs> but, but what was that? If the Grave Walker tries to do what to you, you'll what? You, you, you'll, you'll run away, you'll run away because you're afraid he's going to knife you in the back? Good answer, sir. Good, good answer. 
Because that's exactly what's going to happen. Hey, hey you. Yeah, be, be afraid. Be very afraid of me. And because I did that, now I can go in and I can upgrade that bow now. And now it does 36 increased range damage to dazed captains. Well, that's good to keep in mind. Oh, you're never late, Sonic. Just happy to have you all here tonight as I do my first big stream as a Twitch partner now, which as I was saying before we started, you can now, you can now tip me legit. You can now subscribe if you're so interested. So yeah, whoever gets to be the first subscriber, that'll be interesting. Uh, you can do that. There's bits now. There's the there's the whole shebang. There's also still the PayPal link for those who like that. There's still Gokbox who want to tip me for free. They're a great new service that uh, if you have a mobile device, essentially you can tip me for free by uh, watching a trailer or uh, downloading an app or something. It's actually quite cool. I know if there were Twitch streamers out there I really wanted to support, I would do something like that without having to actually open up my wallet. Ooh. Yeah, the Marauder Tribe is just so cool. I love the gold and white that all the forts get when you uh, take them over. Alright, so what do we got here? For our first defense. I wonder if this also scales with me. Because I was clearly supposed to do this earlier in the game, but I didn't. Hold the region of Nern as long as Saren's forces are preparing to attack to retake the thing. Okay, I can do that. I can defend. Also, too, maybe I can control some of the attackers now that I killed, uh... What is it? Friggin' Metal Beater the Traitor. What kind? Was Talion taking a whiz right there? The way they were framing him with his hands down? What's the trouble? You're pretty chill about it. Hello, whoever just joined. Bruce? Yeah. That sounds like a job for Overlord What's his name? Seeing as how I was passed over. Oh yeah, Bruce is all pissed off because I didn't name him Overlord of the area. I would have picked him, but the game actively doesn't let you pick him. Just having a laugh. You know how I love snapping off heads. How could you not want to promote Bruce? He's big as several brick shit houses all duct taped together. He has a wonderfully affable personality. Oh yeah, War Games was tonight, Wade. I'm probably going to watch that when I go to bed. I'm always sure to save it and watch it later. But work comes first. Thor will be up. Uh, oh, it's been out for like 10 minutes right now. So there's that on my channel and Superman tomorrow morning. Also, thanks everyone for watching my Justice League video. That one did way better numbers than my Thor review. Doug's the obvious. <laughs> Alright, I'm defending. I'm so good at defending, you're not even going to get in the front door. Yeah, I wanted you to. Mm-hmm. I see. I see why they call you the obvious. Indeed you are. Oh, and you're a vault breaker. Ain't that, ain't that just quaint? And you're fr frostproof too, Jesus Christ, none of my tricks work on you. And you got a whole freaking gang of these jerks. At least you're not arrow-proof, that's good. And I can curse you, so that's nice. my team strong enough to hold out on this one. I know I had 
quite a few dudes, but I would have liked more dudes. And I know I want more dudes. There you go. You, you freaking join me. There you go. You'll make up for the dude that I had to kill. There you go. No, definitely stay and fight for me. Help repel your own dudes now. So I guess I gotta take out all of these guys. Hopefully they don't have more BS attached to them. Oh, I see one. I see one. It, it, come on, do, do the cool legless thing. Or whatever. That's getting a little squirrely with everyone all here together. I see you. I'm gonna consume you, Dark. From your charred Vlog. bones to your sizzling flesh. And if I do it right, disgusting. You'll be live and wriggling. Oh shit. Uh, whoever died just dropped a bunch of bombs. Eh, you weren't so tough, Vlog. Kicked your ass. Oh, we got even more now. Well, they, uh, they really don't give you much of a chance, do they? Oh, and one of my dudes is dying out there. Great. What are you mad about? Apparently you get a skill later on where you can heal your dudes from afar. That would be really nice right about now. Yeah, you live. I can't lose nobody. Oh, great. Another mush mouth. Oh, the moaner. You must be a big hit at parties. I can just tell. Here, come back. Oh, god damn it. Is that Bruce who got hurt? Yeah, it is. Oh, who are you now? Who the fuck are you? This is just getting goddamn nuts over here, I tell ya. Yeah, okay, everyone... Everyone's just telling me their life story right now. Yep. Yep, you're a very interesting guy. Is, it, is everyone done yet telling me their life story? Also, when you're all bunched up like this, it makes killing you quite difficult. Yeah, the moaner didn't last long. D didn't I already meet you, Nark of the Knife? I'm pretty sure I already met you. And I was none too impressed. I'm trying to bring my dude back. Oh, there goes one of my guys. Uh, Rash the Bladesmith, you, you had a good run, Rash. I guess Narka is not to be trifled with, I suppose. Uh-oh. <laughs> I almost didn't come back from that one. Uh-oh, this I might die on this one. Like for real. Yeah, that one was for real. Jeez, when they all start ganging up on you like that and there's like four chiefs and you can't see what you're doing, that's rough. Luckily, that was a story mission. Now, it's it's these fortress defenses here that got the most flack uh, 
when it came to the whole loot box thing that they were doing where it's like, you know, oh, if you just have enough loot boxes and if you just keep buying enough specialty orcs, you'll always be able to win these fights. If these orcs reach the keep, then that is where Okay, at least it jumps me ahead to this point here. It doesn't uh, punish me too hard. Also, yeah, single, single amount seems to be where it's at. Oh yeah, and you're the moaner. Yeah, the moaner is super weak, once again. Shrack the moaner ain't shit. It's all those other guys I worry about, though. Oh great, now they're, they're blowing up my nice wall. What? No, that was that was my guy. Yeah, Talon, you're a little devil may care with your swings. Come on, come on. Hey, camera. Yeah, this is a little chaotic. I've been fighting you this whole time and you're only just introducing yourself? Alright. Yes, you're plenty fierce. You've got a skull on your head. Everyone's really impressed. Oh, did I not? He killed me the last time, too. Jesus Christ. Yeah, yeah, Shelob, we're all very impressed. Jeez, I'm just not having a good night tonight, are I? Or am I? Am I, are I? You know what I mean. Yeesh. Could be doing better. How, how you chat doing? I legit thought you smashed through the wall. It looked like I smashed through the wall on my own, didn't it, Sonic? Yeah. And now it drops me back in a completely different place. That's weird. Sup with that. I was in the inner wall before, and now I'm out here. Oh, enraged by injury. That's that's always good. Oh, you again. I want to savor your I didn't get to see you the last time. Be so delicious. Let's get it on. Jesus. There, I knocked you off your Karagor, idiot. And he's immune to executions. Awesome. Because that's what I want. This shit is crazy. Uh, would someone like to help me, please? I'm getting ganged up on over here. And that guy's just sailing through the air. You know, it happens. God, I can't even get a freaking freezing shot off on this dude. He's just not having any of it. Right. 
Yeah, here, you... You give me some health, and also, I'm gonna recruit you to fight for my side, because I need some more dudes right now. Yeah, please, please do. Stay and fight for me and beat up the dudes you came with. That would be nice. If you, if you feel like killing someone on your way out, that'd be a big help. <laughs> Let me just kite this dude. Apparently, uh, what is it? The moaner's ready to die, so I should probably take him out. Oh, one of my other dudes is dying. Oh, God, they're gonna make me go all the way back here, aren't they? Oh, good, my guys took out the moaner. I feel good about that. He was, he was weak sauce. I'm glad, I'm glad my grunt force could handle him. Hey, come on, do, do, do a cool thing, do a cool thing. Come on, Bruce, get back in the fight. God, he just goes freaking nuts. So there's just nothing you could do. No, don't kill me again. And he's execution proof, so even when I do one of those, it doesn't matter. Now, I would like to kite you away from here. Yeah, Jesus Christ, that guy's becoming my worst frickin' nightmare, I tell you. Hey, hey, one of you guys, I know you're on my team, but my need is greater than yours right now. Give me some health, please. Also, clearly, Bruise can't die because Bruise is story important, so I don't have to worry about saving his life, clearly. Would be nice to have some more people fighting on my side, though. As apparently all my dudes are falling all over the place to this one, one orc. The terror is killing all my dudes. Apparently no one is as good as the terror. because he's enraged by injury, so nothing hurts him. Come on, get back up, get back in there. Is he dead yet? Nothing fucking hurts this guy. Come on, come on, come on. Yeah, he gets enraged by friggin' injury, so, like, n n nothing hurts him. Again, gotta run and come back. 
That freaking guy. When he, what do you do when they're enraged by injury? Hey, you. Give me, give me some health. Here, let me try and save one of my guys over here who's bleeding out. Because here's the thing, if you don't heal your dudes, they will turn on you. And I don't need that, I don't need any more betrayers on my side. Maybe if I get some air, that'll help me. I can't, it's this one guy, this one guy is giving me this trouble now. He had a good raw knock of the knife. Again, just because this one guy has the randomness and the deck stacked in his favor, I, I just can't do anything to him. But he was weak to stealth. He was weak to stealth, so a st single stealth attack killed him. I couldn't do anything else to him, but by jumping up high, I was able to get him. Amazing. And oh look, because a bunch of dudes died around here, they dropped a bunch of legendary and epic gear. Well, that's alright. I'll just take that then. Yeah, they're definitely making me earn my keep, or fortress. Although I guess fortress keep, interchangeable. I can't believe that one generic dude gave me as much trouble as he did. See, this is this is what's wonderful about this game and what's horrifying about this game. Any one dude can become the toughest, cheapest, most unstoppable boss. I guess it does just make, you know, try and do a little bit of everything to stop him, though. Like, again, I tried every attack combination possible, and then I'm like, well, I guess I just gotta stealth him. Alright, what do we got going on here? What's what's happening? What's the haps, guys? Oh, well, I'm glad I could remind you, Enigma. It's a fun game, Enigma. Has its moments. Oh, I'm glad you had fun. My people, give me a hug. Oh, bruise, you dirty fuck, you. Oh, 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 you think, you think you smart, you think, you think you good and clever. Bruise the betrayer. You trifling ass Olog biatch. Sleep with one eye open, man, cause I'm a-coming for you. It is pretty funny, though, that they make him, like, the best, like, most fun character. And then he betrays you. Oh, oh, look at you. Look at you. You're a big, shiny overlord now. And at least I leveled up a lot. I'm coming for you, son. I'm coming for you. Yeah. We'll retake our fortress. We will slaughter that wretched Olog and all who stand with him. Mm hmm. And what of the ones who stand with us? Eh. Clearly, their loyalty cannot be trusted. 
All who resist will be made an example. <laughs> what is that? That's what I'm gonna do to Bruce when I get my hands on him. Well, you know, betrayal is a pretty damn solid motivator, I would say. All right, what uh, what do I got going down here? Eh, you know, the glaive, I just don't like the glaive. The glaive does nothing for me. Dominate captain, okay, I can do some stuff here. Destroy followers, I can kill everyone who follows me, don't know why I'd want that. Heal nearby followers by consuming your health, any followers who are near, hmm. Enrage followers. Nearby fallen league captains will consumes wraith, but they get enraged, which means they're tougher to take down. And I mean, I guess it's easier than going through the thing. Clearly, this is one they want me to have. So yeah, I'm gonna take that. I'm gonna check out my inventory, see if anything I have is better or worse. Uh, much worse. I will destroy that for cash. I'll destroy that for cash. Dagger. I'm, I'm loving the dagger I have right now. Yeah, destroy that. Dotes need it. Armor, better or worse? Worse. Worse. Although it could possibly be better if I was willing to put the work into it, but no, nah, I'm, I'm pretty good with what I got right now. I got a pretty solid killer loadout. So if I'm going to have to retake this fort, I'm probably going to need some heavy hitting... OG Ologs to help me out because my own guys got hurt quite a bit in that fight. He he has no chiefs helping him out, so it's just him, so it should be a little easier. Who do I still have? I got the Warbringer. I got... Oh, Dugs the Obvious. Hey, tell you what, Dugs, I like you. Dugs. Become my bodyguard. You're You're funny. Every, every team needs a funny one. Every team has a funny one. So I got you. I got the Discipline Master. I got... Horza the Sweet. Which, that's a funny name. I don't know what makes him so sweet. Og the Ruinous. Oh, this is the guy who I did have in charge a while ago, but he got defeated. Yeah, I think what I'm going to do is... I'm actually going to go to the market... I'm gonna get some new crates and I'm gonna I'm gonna buy myself an army. I'm gonna buy me some heavy hitters to come help me out is what I'm gonna do. I could probably do it with the guys I have right now, but I could also do this. And because look, look how much Miri and I have. It's like friggin' burning a hole in my pocket and to make matters even better, these guys level up with me, and because I'm like level 30-something, and everyone else was level like, you know, 20-something in that attack, oh, I can give one of my guys a cursed weapon, that's always good. These, these are the ones I find the most fun. I got Grisha the Sky, he's a dark marksman, and we got Shaka the Thinker, he's a thinker, he thinks good. Oh, he's cool looking. Oh, I like him a lot. He's a machine tracker. Now let's uh, let's get a couple more boxes. Well, I don't want five. It's like here you can have one or five. Like what? 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 Why can't I have two? Why must I get them in such crazy denominations? All right, yeah, sure. Give me give me fives worth. Why? Why the fuck not? Again, I'm I'm big money, Joel. I can do it. Uh, Ratbag, uh, to answer your question, Enigma, hey, spoiler for Mordor, but it's not much of a spoiler. He seemingly died, only he didn't. It's a whole thing. Ooh, Hoglik the Dismembered. Oh, look at that, he's got like a little claw for a hand. Oh, I like him a lot, he's a terror destroyer. Yeah, that's the sort of guy you make an overlord. Yeah, Mug the Defiler, I got a reassignment order. Yeah, open my next chest, what else do I got? Come on, any day now. Uh, I got some shield guys and some axe guys. And I have another curse weapon. Booble the maddest one. Not just a mad one, he's the maddest one. He's a feral berserker, a warmonger tank. Scoff the chop. Yeah, alright. Let's keep opening these bad boys. 
Yeah, the thinker, he teaches all the other orcs about quantum physics. That's, that's his place in the army, to teach everyone quantum physics. Uh, I'm not going to open everyone, because I think some of these do, uh, what is it, uh, level with me, so I don't need everybody. Gruck Ghoul Hunter, he's got a fire weapon, that's always good. Machine Beastmaster, Gluck of the Strong. Feels like I get a lot of Beastmasters in these, feels like I keep getting a lot of the same guys. And hey, you know what, screw it, while we're here, let's, uh, let's buy us some, uh, other gear too, just for the hell of it. Again, I don't think anything's better than what I currently have, but you know, when you're on a friggin' spree, you're on a spree, so let's see what we got. I think I got Drake Scale Armor in one of these things, so you can actually get some crazy cool shit. I have the Gondorian Dagger... And the Numerian cloak, so you know, nothing, nothing big, nothing, nothing too crazy. Again, better or worse? Yeah, slightly better. Use quick throw to hit an enemy on fire. Okay, I'll remember to do that. Yeah, this is way worse. Yeah, luck of the draw, not good at all. Burning that shit up. Selling all these white ones for Mirian, I don't need them. All these rangers cloaks, no, 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 thank you. Uh, all right. Oh, I think I got some gems too. From that, I think I can forge up some of these gems into something meaningful. Yeah, I got another level in wealth gem if I ever wanted to put that on anything. Which I don't. I think the wealth gem is best served on the ring because it means anyone you capture uh, instantly uh, gains a couple levels, which is always good. Alright, so of all the guys I have, and I have a fair amount, common, legendary. Alright, let's, let's, let's get some hard-hitting mofos up in here. I wish, uh, I wish you could assemble this by level. That would be nice. Oh, no, you can't see the level. 38, 38, 34, 28. Okay, this guy I definitely want. Yeah, deploy him to help me out. Yeah, deploy the dismembered. I'm going to definitely want his help taking this stuff back. I want all my strongest dudes. Now, it's funny. Uh, a couple of those guys who died in that siege originally who work for me... I truly wonder if we're going to end up seeing them again in any capacity, because uh, that, that totally happens. Uh, level 20, level 35. Uh, that's machine. At least I think... No, no that, that, that's their class, not their tribe. Still trying to figure all these out. Gruck the Ghoul Hunter... Mug the Defiler, and he's cool. Yeah, I definitely want you on my team. Yeah, deploy me a Warmonger tank. Now, these guys usually take the place of someone who's dead, or if they're not dead, they'll uh, fight someone and take their place, which is always cool. And, uh... Yeah, I guess put this in here, too. I could use another big giant guy. Even though he's slightly weaker, he is epic, and if he dies during a fortress raid, uh, I actually get whatever he drops. Which is always nice. You always want some of that. Alright, I'm feeling good here. So is the next mission literally just retake the area? Uh, looks like it is. New... Damage. <laughs> Bruise is riding high. Bring him low. Yes, yes, please. I would like to do that. Oh, wow. When he takes over the area, too, he gets new monuments he puts up. Yeah, wow. They really, they really do it. New monuments all over the place, which I could break down for more stones if I was so interested. We cannot let his betrayal go unanswered. No, no, we can't. Oh, oh, you guys are blue. You guys are still on my team. I didn't know I still had team guys when I lost the area. I guess I did. Hey, hey. Knife in the guts. 
Knife goes in, guts come out. That's what this shit is all about. Damn right. Now, how am I gonna bring him low, I wonder? Am I gonna embarrass him? Am I gonna write mean things on his orc Facebook page? Am I gonna send him a bunch of pizzas he didn't order? I hate Ratbag. Literally stabbed you in the back. That's not figurative. I was there, Ratbag. The point is, the other orcs know that you had brews with your... Mm -hmm. <laughs> That's a good quote. Which has caused quite an impression, let me tell you. Orcs are lining up to follow him. Ugh. Now, I'm not one to tell you how to do your business, but you need to put a stop to him right away. And you might want to mount some risk. Oh, Phil Lamar, you're so much fun. Yeah, he's taken over a bunch of prisoners. One of whom is your overlord, I'm pretty sure. Ah. I want to save him. Where? So I gotta go save the ruinous. Really, it was like you were stuck on a spin. Just <laughs> quiet. There are three prisoners. You go in and do your thing. I'll stay back in Scotty area. And let me guess, all three of these prisoners are actually dudes who worked for me. Oh no, he has the amputator. Oh wait, actually, wait, wait, wait actually, 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 uh, Luga, the amputator was my strongest guy from Shadows of Mordor, if you watched me play that one. Oh, that's cool. I wondered when he was going to show up. Oh, that's great. He showed up here. Oh, I totally got to save him. He's an advanced assassin. He's got a triple strike. He's agile. He's got no chance and a machine hook. Oh, yeah, he was he was the best. Are, uh, are these other guys dudes from my Mordor save file? They probably are. I don't know why they wouldn't be. Yeah, I, I free you, my peeps. Yeah, the Bright Lord never forgets a friend. Now, who's this one? Taka Warbreak. No, yeah, him I remember. Taka. Yes, Taka I recruited in this one. I can count. Oh, well, that'll come in handy. <laughs> I can count. That will come in handy, he says. Oh, wow. All these cages are filled with my dudes, too. They just. They just captured anyone who was loyal to me. I was afraid there was Karagors inside here, but now I know there isn't. So Bruce has basically been running around and telling all the orcs of Mordor I ain't shit. Oh, you're cool. Mm. Yeah, you're overworked, man. I, I feel ya. If you feel that this organization, this new organization, is not using you to your full potential, then I would like to give you a new business offer wherein I break your mind. Yeah, join me. Yeah, see, you are very affable, and you stay and fight for me, too. I like your flaming sword and your moxie, kid. You'll you'll go far in this organization, I'm sure. And uh, who's uh, who's this last guy I'm saving? Is he anybody? Horza the Sweet. Yeah, okay, him I remember. It was kind of hard to top that first guy, though, who I absolutely remembered. I'm gonna poison your grog. At least I think I poisoned your grog. There, I poisoned it twice. And now the battle has been joined. There was one back here I missed. Yes, 
Got to rebuild my ranks, man. Got to get my rep back in Mordor. That two-timer bruise, man. He really, he really hurt my name out on them streets. So, sorry I forgot to free you last. <laughs> my bad. Sorry I walked right past. Guess that's it then. Yeah. You can get back to your warmongering and, uh, I'll... That's the plan. We are not done here. There's still many more asses to kick. Bruce. Where is he? Bruce. In his fortress. I mean, my fortress. A lot of owners at fortress. And really, it has. was mine. It's a wee bit drafty, but oh, the view. I made a lot of improvements to that place. Oh, yeah. Like your tunnel. Oh. Yeah. An escape tunnel, smart thinking, I thought. You know, great if you need to get out, that's for sure. Maybe you're not as dumb as I thought, Ratbag. We could use it to get back in. <gasps> right. Booyah. Where is this tunnel? Underground. This way. <laughs> I'm pretty sure. I don't know if we can trust him, but he's the best chance we got. Uh, look, look, look at you, you dirty, traitorous bastard, you. Don't worry, I just let myself in. Welcome back, boss. Mm-hmm. So what was the plan? Rescue your boys? I did. Bring them here for some kind of reckoning? Yeah. Go along that little shrug stay rat bag. Yeah, I don't love him. Personally, I prefer you. We can have a real party, a rice shindig, yeah? We can have some grog, play a few fun parties. Aww. Pull the arms off the rain. See, see who doesn't like Bruce? He stabbed me in the back, literally, and I still like him more. Oh, shit. Oh wow, this really is a brawl too. He's got all his people, I've got all my people. Are you are you fighting a ghost, buddy? Yeah, this uh this one really is a freaking blitz, man. And he's vigilant against stealth, because of fucking course he is. Good, good, good job, Taka, good job. You, you get a cookie when all of this is over. Are, are you also one of mine? Okay, good job, Horza. Cookie for you also. There will be many an orc cookie when all of this is done. Better be one of my guys. Oh wow, Horza, two kills in one fight. You, you, you an MVP, dog. You, you, you my boy. You my main boy right now. You have very much reached the status of boy. No. Oh, you just you just ghosted through the wall there, did ya? You will find him and use him to show all of Mordor what happens to those who oppose the Bright Lord. Yeah. Yeah. I don't know who you are, but you're serving me now. Ooh, spiders.
I like I like that Calabrimbor is straight thugging right here right now. Can't let him ruin our rep, man. We're gonna hit the streets. We're gonna hit his mama's house. We're gonna not care who we hurt. We're gonna get him, man. <laughs> yeah, it did feel like I was trying to fight Casper there for a second, Wade. You're not wrong. Yeah, Sonic, you're right about Ratbag. He is the ultimate failure in coming up with ideas. Yeah, I don't know what to think, Enigma, about that Amazon Lord of the Rings series. I mean, what can you really do that the six other movies didn't do? Also, didn't do with way more money on their side. I mean, really, the only thing they can do is if they go full-on Cimmerillion. It's really the only thing they can do is just do all that appendix information that wasn't in the movie. Yeah, now it's mine now. I retook this fortress from Bruise the Betrayer. Now it's mine again. I'm going to make sure no one takes it this time. I'm going to put my strongest boys in charge. Which actually reminds me, who are my strongest boys? Level 38, 29, 20, 23, 19, 21, 37, 25, 27. Yeah, all right. Uh, Hoglick the Dismembered, you getting promoted, man. You getting promoted to the top. You going there, man. Yeah. And then I guess the next strongest war chiefs get promoted as well. Or do I get to pick that? I always like to pick. I'm only about four to five episodes into Punisher Netflix, enjoying what I'm seeing, but definitely going at my own pace, which pacing, you know, that's always kind of been a thing for the Marvel Netflix show. I will say I enjoy the pacing of this one better than I enjoy Defenders or Iron Fist. No, oh, I can't actually have my guys go right up there. They gotta do it themselves. All right. Horrors of the Sweet, I command you to become a war chief. Oh, no, I can't move you. Because you killed so many dudes in that fight, you really deserve to be a war chief. And who is the next strongest? Scoth the Chop, I also command you. Actually, I'd like to give you some training orders, because I have it. I would like to give you a cursed weapon so you can have an epic trade and you can be really tough. Because I'm nice like that. Oh, look how happy he is. I cursed his weapons. Yeah, I would like to command you to reposition. Yeah. So now if anyone ever online tries to take my fortress, I'll have some tougher dudes. Which, uh, oh no, he's still my bodyguard, he's in the middle of something. Yeah, I would like to guard him. Keeping the Warmonger tribe with the Warmonger tribe. Cause I'm like that. Command. Guard him, please. I want to give everyone at least a couple bodyguards, make it tough. Marauder Tracker, Poisonous Mystic, Marauder Destroyer, yeah, guard him, guard him up good. I, I know you used to be War Chief, but you were also stronger when I was here last. Muzug. Man, you, you got an epic trade on you too, man. I haven't seen a spider guy before, you're, you're pretty creepy and pretty great. Doug's the obvious. Oh, I can't move him. I can't move the Fiery Terror Slayer, though. That way, they got two apiece, two apiece. Command. Tell you what, you guard him because he only... Because he's a lower level, so I'll need you to guard him. There we go. Did, did, did a lot of good today, I feel. Look, look, look how many dead people are down here, though. Look, look, look at how everyone got freaking murked out in this field. Now, where is, where's my next mission? Missing. Let's, let's keep following this quest line. 
It appears Ratbag has need of us. Came <laughs> out, but do not let him distract you from our true mission. How did you know Ratbag needs you? Did he call you on his orc telephone to tell you that it was happening? You just kind of seem to know that. Do you and Ratbag have some manner of psychic link I don't know about? I mean, it's fine if you do. Just, you know, figured I'd ask. Actually, hey, uh, I think I got a lot of loot off that one, too, I didn't bother to look at. Uh, alright. Better or worse? Slightly worse. But also an epic, so I don't want to get rid of it. Mm, I just passed it, and I'm guessing it's worse. Yeah, clearly, clearly worse, because it didn't even pop up. Better or worse? Worse. So everything I got from that was worse. That's what I get for doubling back. Uh, but yeah, to bring it back to the Punisher there, because someone asked, I can tell, see you guys are still talking about it in the chat there. Uh, what I like about the Punisher is that uh, John Bernthal, Frank Castle's character, hates man buns as almost as much as I do, which is nice. He talked about his disdain for it, and that's, that's just always good. When anti-life justifies my hate of a terrible hairstyle. Which I wondered why in Batman v Superman when we saw the clip with the Flash where it's like, why? Why does Barry Allen suddenly have a man bun, but why does he not have it in Justice League? Apparently the answer to that is, when I looked at pictures of Ezra Miller uh, for my video review, apparently that's just his regular everyday haircut. And they didn't tell him to get one for Batman v Superman, so that's why he just has a man bun, because that's just what Ezra Miller wears. So, you know, there's, there's one to grow on. There's, there's one to think about. And also, I was nowhere near that poison jet, and yet somehow my Karagor still got poisoned. Time to go in the spooky cave. Alright, so what, what do we gotta do next to track down that backstabbing bastard bruise? who broke the bro code, our bonds of brotherhood. Not gonna stop until I kick his ass. Microchip, from what I've seen, actually does have a fair amount of character development. Not to spoil it, but I like they've essentially made him an inverse of Frank himself and his own personal tragedy. Oh, yeah. Like literally killing the messenger. <laughs> I never noticed it too, but when you look at Ratbag on his left side, he has a big scar on his head. No doubt the injury he suffered in the first game. Sorry. You realize this is a trap. But you owe me. And you owe Ranger. Oh yeah, his big Olog buddy is called Ranger. Not exactly how I remember it. Oh, we're your boys. That's so sweet. Eh. <laughs> look, 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 Talion, in the Elvish gang world, respect means everything, and we gotta take it to these guys, and we gotta make an example of them. We gotta arrow gat all of them, and their families, and their people, and people who owe the money. <laughs> Do I have to follow? No, I don't have to follow you. I can just go on my own. All right. Yeah, just just like in the old days, you were a friggin' escort mission back then, and you're an escort mission the now. I may need your help. The stealth in this game is great because it gives you like a couple seconds before they spot you. So you can literally see them be like, oh god, there's a guy there, only for it to, you know, be too late. 
Which is pretty true to real life, too, you know, the average person's reaction time, or orc in this case, his reaction time is gonna be a few seconds. That's my name, don't wear it out, traitor. Crapper. Oh, the orcs have such fun put-downs. It's true, Ratbag, you should probably hang back if you don't want to get hurt. You've proven you are very ungood at fighting. Mmm. Man, you you've got a very, very good PR department. You're just making all these new hires. Also, they're all riding dire caragors, which sucks. Because again, say it with me now, everybody. Dire caragors are the worst. Eh, so much for that attack. I was hoping if I could nail them in a big area of effect, but apparently no. Is it dead yet? Is it dead yet? Also, do I need to be protecting Rat? I probably need to be protecting him, don't I? See, the arrows did so much damage, but my sword is apparently doing piddly-ass damage. Hey, there's some arrows over here. I would like some arrows, please. Arrows for Talion. Oh, there we are. Oop. Nope, too much of a jump. Jump, jump less than that. There we go, that's what I'm talking about. Now y'all fuckers don't got a chance. No chance, that's what you got up against a machine too strong. Crazy politician. I, I don't really remember how the rest of that song goes. Oh, killing the ambushers also includes killing the Karagors. Yeah, yeah, that's what I think about your stupid albino Karagors. I think they suck and I don't like them. Dude, he's long gone. I appreciate your yelling, but he's long gone, dude. I'm not done with him. Listen to me. We will find Ranger. Yes, we'll find your friend and potential lover. I'm not just gonna sit on my ass and wait. Nor should you. Please do. I'll do. You will be the first to know. Eh, good. I, I would hope you would tell me first. Bruce is just the beginning. Is he? The more power we gain, the more others will seek to challenge it. Mm, it's always the game, man. No, he must be made an example of, or others will rise. Heavy is the head that wears the crown. You gotta make examples. Why kill countless challengers when you can stop it all by breaking one? Oh. Because we are here to win a war. And not play your politics. Yeah, let's play a little politics. Come on. Oh, snap, Calibrimbor. Kicking that street knowledge, that hot, hot elven street knowledge. Because the game don't change, playboy. The game changed you. Rally to his cause. Popping off heads is hardly a cause. But you're right. We need to deal with him. Oh, no. Popping off heads is kind of a cause. Cause for concern, perhaps. All right, what do we, what do we got next here? We got... The Poisoned Road. Bruce has captured your followers again. Why do my followers keep getting captured? Save them before he kills them. I mean, I thought the whole point of having badass orc followers is that I didn't have to play babysitter all the time, that they could watch out for themselves, but apparently not. Also, is that mission even in this area? Uh... 
No, apparently, yep, yeah, the completely different place. Even though all the missions have been taking place here, I met Bruce here. This mission taking place somewhere else completely. How you doing, chat, while I wait for this to load? Oh, I know, right, Sonic? Imagine if these guys were to do, the same guys who made this, Monolith, if they were able to make a Lord of the Rings game. How amazing that would be. You could use the Nemesis system for it, because you're always making enemies, and people are always betraying you, and they're always dying. It would be awesome, but I would hate Warner Brothers to do it, because of all the, you know, loot box nonsense. I would hate to see what they would put into it. Alright, how far am I away from it? Yeah, it's, it's surprising there's been no truly great Game of Thrones game. Like, the Telltale one is fun, but it's funny they've never done, like, an action-y one. Well, they did. They did, it just wasn't very good. Maybe Game of Thrones isn't right for an action-type game. Because so much of it is just talking and intrigue and everything. Alright, so we're gonna go into the spooky spider cave. For this next mission, nothing bad ever happens in this cave. Except everything bad happens in this cave. Alright, what, what, what do you got, Bruise, you backstabbing betrayer bastard? Also, too, once I'm done this quest line for tonight, I'll stick around and do commentary like I did. Or, uh, commentary and a Q&A. So be sure to hang out when we're done here. When we're done playing, I'll stay on camera and answer questions. Mm-hmm. Also, uh, next game I play, maybe something that doesn't require all the Twitch time to hit all the counter prompts, I'll put the question thing on the side of the screen so I can actually read them more frequently and not have to keep looking down. I just figured for a big action game like this, uh, speed is important, and when you have the little question thing pulled out on the side, it usually costs you like a second. Uh. Okay, Samurai Jack. Because that's who you are. You're Samurai Jack, you're Hermes Conrad, you're a bunch of different characters. Who who did he take? Uh, Oogle, I don't remember you, Oogle, sorry. Well, I guess he kidnapped guys from this area, is why. This is a cool area, though, this whole cave system where everything keeps building up and up and up. I remember the first time I booted the game up and I was playing in this area, it completely did my head in, but with how vertical it is. That is something really nice that they changed about this game in particular. That they built so much of it up, where everything else was kind of like big and expansive. Oh, still above me. Hey, hey you. You're my, you're my ticket to getting up. Stabby, stabby. Stabby stabby fun times. God damn, this thing just keeps going and going and going. Where are you going? You ain't going nowhere. I bet. Who's uh who's cursing me out down there? Some sort of big bruise fanboy? Saying how bruise was great until he met me and I changed the cannon. He'll, he'll break the walls down. He'll break the walls down like Jericho. He sounds like quite a bloke, this guy. It's funny, you know, Bruise was so big and popular with all the E3 trailers and everything, and I remember so many people were disappointed, myself included, when we found out that Bruise was actually, uh, in the story meant to betray you. And that sucks, because he's so much fun. 
I think they I think they greatly overestimated how much people liked Ratbag from the first game. Yeah, he was fun, but Bruise had all the potential of being new Ratbag. Well, I mean, it is a game. <laughs> Evil laughter. Again, who is cursing me out right now? I can hear a voice. God, I'm just a killing machine once you get into a good groove in this game. Just nothing can stop you. Sucks about my followers all being on other ledges, though. That means they can't really come and help me. And an arrow for you. <laughs> Were you the guy talking shit? Yeah, talk talk shit about this. Oh hey, uh, the swarm. One of my best guys. A dude who tried to kill me and who's come back several times. Oh, there's the, there's the shit talker. Oh, great, this guy's all poisonous and shit. Hey, little, 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 little help out here, guy? Thank you. Yep, that's my name. The Plan Maker. Jeez, if you love Bruce so much, why don't you just marry him? Good, 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 good. My boys are here. You, you, you guys got this. You, you guys got it, and you know it. Y'all, y'all guys got this. Just, 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 just be whooping his ass. Just, just keep whooping his ass for me, guys. I'm, I'm getting hurt, boss. Boss has got to hang out for a bit, but you know I'll, I'll empower you. That's a thing I can do. Shit. Actually, hey, can I break the plan maker? That'd be fun. Hey, you served Bruise. You thought Bruise was so great. Well, guess what? Well, now you're gonna join the army of the Bright Lord. And you're gonna see how great I am. Uh, yeah, you can retreat for now. Me off, eh? good, 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 good job, boys. That was good teamwork on all of our parts. We, we, we did the thing. Oh, nice, and I, and I won a crystal for that one. <laughs> Is that what you would call Italian antics? Make an example of him so that he will serve as a warning to mm -hmm. Jeez, if trying to kill you is antics, I would hate to know what you think shenanigans are. Eh, what do I got here? Ooh, upgrade the Italian Strike or Eagle Sight. Focus is consumed at a slower rate, so I can be slower, or I can do a big crazy ground pound attack. Yeah, I'm gonna go with ground pound. Who doesn't love pounding some ground? Or anything else for that matter. Uh, all right, so what do we got here at 78% this is this has got to be the uh, finale or close to the finale of the brew storyline Radbag thinks he's found Ranger meet him. All right, I'll do that I'll meet him and I'll read the chat while I do <laughs> Bruise and his wool and his lollygagging for real he did dodge that arrow like Neo. That guy was pretty good. I'm all right, you know, getting him on my side. Yeah, wouldn't that be nice, Sonic? Maybe he will be back in game three if he doesn't get his head chopped off. We'll see. We'll see how this all ends. It could go either way at this point. And also, hey, thank you for 10 people sticking around and watching me. That means a lot here on this, my first Twitch partner stream. 
Again, if you want to subscribe now to this and support the stream, you can. If you want to do the bits thing, you totally can. It's all, it's all open now. I have an Amazon gear thing now, which I'm not 100% sure how that works, as I was saying, so I just filled it with stuff I liked, like Steven Universe art books and Bullet Club hoodies. And also games I plan to play in the future, probably for streams, like uh, that Wolfenstein collection, and Wolfenstein 2, and Yakuza 6. Although that'd probably be a weird one to play for people, Yakuza 6, just to start that one out, because that's such a weird niche set of games, and the sixth one in the series. Even though it looks super awesome, because it's like actually made for next gen and everything. Oh, hey, I'm seeing custom emotes and stuff now, too. Yeah, you can do that stuff, too. Which means eventually I'll have to learn how to make an official one for the stream. What are what are some belovable Cape Joel quotes that I've gotten so far? I think I'm trying to get better or worse over when it comes to looking at my gear. I do that a lot. What, what, what other wonderful catchphrases could I get over? I guess only time will tell. I forget what it was, but uh, I asked on one podcast uh, for the comic multiverse when we were making shirts, what are some quotes or some stuff we say all the time? And I was actually surprised by the stuff I say a lot. I'm like, do I really say that a lot? Hey, let me try my new ground pound now that I got it. Pound the ground! Oh yeah, look at that. They were not expecting the ground near them to get pounded so hard. And I'm gonna pound the ground again with fire. The ground is so hot after I pounded it. And there was a fair amount of guys here. Boom. Boom, boom. Daggers, daggers for everybody. Curse daggers, no less for everybody. Alright, let's let's do this. Oh, oh wait, that wasn't the mission. Wait, where where am I supposed to be going? Am I above or below it? Bloodsport? Yeah, I did that. At least I think I did that. Kerrigan quest, bruise quest, a sighting. Yeah, okay. Am I right on top of it? I thought it was right on top of it. Oh, there it is. He's more persistent than I thought. If he keeps this up, he will embolden other orcs to resist us. Gotta, g gotta take that fool out, Talion. He's disrespecting you. Gotta make him put some respect on your name. Yeah, Red, that, that is the thing I say for the podcast. I gotta make some up new shit up for the stream. Ranger, Gravewalker, Talion. I got at least three names. Right, and also you're a coward. That also helps. Not really. I mean, I think you're kind of entertaining, and I like the fact that you're voiced by Phil Lamar, but beyond that, no, Ratbag, I don't think much of you. But you do have a lot more personality than the human characters in this game, so I'll give you that. It helps you raise above your station as just like an escort mission guy. Just, just gonna sit down there, bud? Okay, you're just gonna sit down. Gonna sit down and let me go first, because of course you are. Uh, sup, Bruce? What's wrong? You got an army to raise and a war to win. Mm hmm. You are wasting time trying to rescue a brainless rock. I've already took over this area. You had better be quick, because a pack of my categories woke up in a foul mood this morning. Uh huh. So I decided to cut him loose. Ugh, more with the Karagors. This is, this is why you're the worst, Bruce. This, this right here, your love of hungry Karagor packs makes you the worst. Will be a 
is is Bruce supposed to be standing in front of me right now or did he glitch out? Hello? Hello? I I can't move. Oh. That was a weird ass delay. That was a very weird ass delay. Just stop me dead there while they were getting the timer to work. That's definitely not Ranger. Nope. Of course it's not Ranger. How'd you get behind me? You were in front of me. No, because you're a villain. Uh, which, 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 which way is out? Oh, I'll get out all right. I'll get out on top of your dead bodies. As Bart Simpson says, I'll choke your wivers with my dead if I have to. Bruce, come out and play. Oh good, just some generic orcs. These guys I can handle. These guys are on my level. In fact, I can kill these guys so easy, it's almost criminal. Headshot for you. Who's who's left? Oh, you had a shield until you didn't. You, sir, I am not a fan of. Hey, you know what? Spiders for you. At least I think that's what that does. Oh no, ghouls, not spiders. Guess what, ghouls? You don't get to kill them because I killed them. Was it a trap? I yeah. How did he double back, Ratbag? How did you let him do that? Oh, well. Nice to see you're still earning your keep. Hey, award for not getting hit by an exploding barrel. This was a waste of time. Not if Radbag manages to track down Bruce. Oh, I'm tripping. I'm tripping hard on the poison. Alright, so what do we got next? Man, I can't believe I'm level 40 already. All right, now this worse than death. This this one has to be the finale. But yeah, let's let's go there. Let's do this. You getting hype chat? You getting super psyched for this? I'm super psyched for it. Noctis and Tal in love whooping as they sure do, Red. They sure do. Welcome to the stream of badassery starring the one and only Cape Joel. I will take these all under advisement. My name is Joel and I like to party. You know, I've heard I've heard worse quotes there, Wade. I've really heard worse. That's what she said. Yeah, there's a lot of that going on. The classiest fucking podcast. Also, hey, good job, Trappy, for cheering. I just noticed you're the first one to cheer. You get to wear that W forever now because you are the first one to cheer on the official Cape Joel partnered stream. That is, this is right now. The history books will say you were the first one. Maximum Dodd levels of hype. You know, a uh, true story about that uh, classiest fucking podcast thing. I actually borrowed that from the old Rage Select podcast. Those guys are really funny, really inspired me. And I don't think that, like, I mean, they're very big amongst their own set of fans. I don't know if they ever really, like, blew up on YouTube or anything. I mean, I think they have more subscribers than me, but I could be wrong. Go go check them out if you like funny Let's Plays. I kind of fell off on them because the original duo don't do it near as much anymore, because, uh, what is it, Jason, who's actually guested on the Comic Multiverse a couple times, he's gone on to do other stuff. Because he's actually getting uh, a lot of good work now. He's on another show, The Modern Rogue, which is also really fun, with uh, Brian Brushwood... Uh, who is a professional stage magician 
who also makes YouTube videos and podcasts on the side and everything. Uh, they were uh, they were all very big inspirations to me for wanting to do what I do. So that's always good. They were they were very funny and very irreverent. And I'm like, well, you know, if they can do that with video games, I'd love to do that with comics. And I like to think I've done that. And now I'm trying to bring all that same energy to streaming. Because that's the thing. And also, if YouTube continues to be to, you know, YouTube, and you keep getting them piss yellow uh, check marks, this will be a good way to kind of help supplement the income for living and everything. Or at least that's the hope. You know, with nice, generous fans like you, that's what I hope I can do. Oh, sorry, I forgot you were on my team. Shit. I just kind of whacked you in the face for no reason. My bad. The Scourge. This is this is the right mission, right? This is the one I want. I just want to take uh, another defense mission if it's not the one I need. No, it's not the mission. Worse than death is the one I want. See, I almost took the wrong mission. Look at that. I almost took the wrong mission. Is that even in this area, the one I want? Yeah, yeah, apparently, no, Bloodsport is in this area. No, no, it's not in this area. Okay, that's one thing I don't like about this game. If you want to follow, like, an actual storyline of the missions in order, they make you jump around from place to place, but at least they offer you a fast travel option. That's always good. Oh, well, that's nice to hear, Enigma. I'm glad uh, we inspired you. That's always nice to hear. <laughs> yeah, Trappy, I guess you are my first mod, that's true. I mean, you're always here, so I can always trust you to be a mod. Luckily, this group is really cool and really nice, and there really doesn't need to be much moderation going on. So that's always good. Can't mess with that. All right. Now, do I got to walk all the way there? Or do I have something closer? It's going to make me walk all the way there, isn't it? Yeah. All right, I'll summon up my Karagor and try and get over there. Do 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 do. Charge, stampede. Now let's take it to this backstabbing jerk. Show him that no one crosses the Grave Walker and his ghost buddy, Kellogg's Boobery. No one crosses us. That's a two best friends joke. They're, they're another big inspiration for me. I guess if I really wanted to ape off their style, I would need a co-host. Which is rough for me, because I live alone. And all my friends are either in college or moved away from this small dead-end town for work, which I cannot blame them. I would do the same if my work were not on the internet. And plus, you know, takes a certain special sort of person to hang with me. Matt, you know, has been my co-host forever because we've been together for so long and we know each other's uh, basic rhythms and patterns to the point we never cut each other off anymore. Okay, Ratbag has discovered Bruce Camp. Rescue Ranger, then put an end to Bruce. Reward the worse than death skill. Which sounds awesome. What's worse than death? And we're gonna find out what's worse than death, that's what. Hey, hey Ratbag, you hiding again? I found Ranger, and I found Bruce. Oh well. This all feels very familiar. It really does. This Ranger explode like the last one. Uh, uh. No, Ratbag is sure this time. While you was all racing into a trap, by the way. Or oh, track down Bruce. The ugly Shrock never saw me. I like the orcs have their own swear words, Shrock. I'm gonna start saying that more often. Hey, Shrockhead. What the Shrock? Faffing about. That's another great one. That's that's British, and I love faffing about. As a term for just screwing around and not doing anything. All right. Bruce doesn't expect us. We should strike now. First, we save Ranger. Ranger is expendable. Mm. Our priority should be making an example of Bruce. He will be dealt with, but we have to make sure Ranger is safe. I kind of agree with Calibrimbor on this one. Also, do you like the orcs, Talion, or do you not like the orcs? That seems to change from uh, storyline to storyline. Well, 
Like you seem bemused by the orcs at best at the best of times. Even though again, I think the orcs actually have a ton of personality. But then it's also like the orcs aren't working for you because they're your friends or, you know, you've got them to see the light and the error of their ways following Sauron. No, they're following you because you completely screwed with their minds, is what happened. They're doing all of this completely against their will. But then again, you could argue that Sauron is screwed with their minds, too, and are forcing them to do stuff against their will. So, I mean, they really... The orcs are the real, uh, you know, friggin' losers of this storyline, I would say. I may need an archer on my side for the coming escape. Oh god, there's a lot of people in between me and there. And I gotta get there without raising an alarm. Yeah, time to time to go high. Time to go high and quick, I say. What's up, Ranger? I found you. I did, I did my duty, even though, I guess you never brain messed with, uh, Ratbag or Ranger, so I suppose they're following you because they genuinely want to? Wait, did you, did you put the brain whammy zammy on Ratbag in the first game, and am I just forgetting? Easy. No, I actually think you save him, and he actually does become your friend. Interesting. Interesting moral quandaries brought up by this game. Is it right to subvert the free will of a race of sentient beings, even if they are a chaotic evil group of sentient beings? <laughs> Would come for your help. What took you so long? Hey, hey. Don't be saucy to me, Ranger. I'll leave you here. But yes, I can walk. <laughs> you know what, Ranger? I like you more than Ratbag. I like your cool kind of only speaks in black speech thing. Which I like they paid reference to that where it's like, wait, the orcs have their own language. Why are they only ever speaking common? All right, you, you, you lead the way, Ranger. I'll follow. I take it you're ready to end this. That makes two of us. Now to make an example of Bruce. Yeah. An example all of mortal. Damn right. What are you gonna do to them to really freak the orcs out? They seem to be like a pretty, pretty hardcore race of people. I don't know what you gotta do to freak them out. We should back to nah. Wait, wait, wait. Who, who are you talking to? Are you insane? Ranger knows I'm talking to Calabrimbor? And who said you could let Ranger out of his cage? Oh, damn, level 40. I'm guessing Bruise is whatever level you are. You can tell he's a big important boss, Bruise, because he's essentially the same level you are. Ah, great, he's arrow proof. But can I stick him? I cannot stick him. That is a stick that cannot be stuck. I'm trying to hurt you, yes, and I'm succeeding. Yes, yes you are frozen solid. That's kind of my bag. Do I have some elven rage? That'd be really good right about now. Feels like it's been a while since I've had elven rage. Slapping your shit, bruise. 
Get ready to get your shit slapped in. Ooh. Alley -oop. Nope, not those guys. Oh, now I got ya. Oh, you dirty bitches. There we go, now I got ya. Now it's time to put you in the worse than death. Shame. Shame. I hit the bell of shame. No. No. And they'll whisper, no. So what's worse than killing him, breaking his mind? Aww. Orcish bromance. You weren't tough enough to save me yourself. See, Ranger's the real MVP here. You're an idiot. Learn some black speech. You embarrass me. It's almost like he's talking. <laughs> He's smarter than him, but he doesn't know. Thank you, Ranger. Uh, Grave Walk. Now, thank you, Oh, I'd have accepted Talion too, but that's pretty nice. Oh, wow. He was so nice when we met him. I feel like kind of a dick. I'd rather die than live like that. Yeah. I guess that's a real orc society thing. Come on, Ranger. Let's get out of here. She's giving me the creeps. Yeah. <laughs> Killing him almost would have been more merciful. You're a cruel one, Grave Walker. Oh shit. You could talk this whole time, you just chose not to. Now every monkey mortal will think twice before challenging us. Yeah, yeah, get respect, yeah. First you get the money, then you get the power, then you shame the Ologs, then profit in there somewhere too, I'm sure. Yeah, that uh, that genuinely was cold-blooded, breaking his mind. Yeah, I I'd watch that animated series, Wade. I I'd watch the adventures of uh, Ratbag and Ranger. See, they got two R's there, you already got alliteration on your side. They'd have a fun theme song, Rat Bag and Ranger, having adventures, getting into problems, learning some lessons. Rat Bag and Ranger. Oh, he's still alive. He's still he's still hanging out there. You know what? I'm gonna mark him. I feel bad for him. I feel I should actually kill him before I end the stream, is what I think I'm gonna do. And also I have a new point I can put in there somewhere. Uh, do I want a deadly strike with the glaive? Mm -hmm. Man, I've almost upgraded every bit of the tree. Deadly strike, mighty swing, double charge. Yeah, I guess I'll put a double charge on McGlave. Why not? Yeah, who uh, who in the chat wants to see me uh, actually go and finish Bruise off this time? I feel like I kind of should, or at least see if I can. I think he's getting into a duel with someone else. But I feel like I don't want to leave this story half finished. The story's not truly over until he's dead. I know they said shaming is worse than death, but you know what's worse than shaming? Death. Death is the ultimate end to any story. Uh, purifies his... Not available. Why is it not available? Yeah, I'll try my hand at killing him, and then I will uh, do my normal outro for a stream, and then uh, once that's done, I'll hang out for a bit, and I'll take uh, some Q&A, some video Q&A from you all. I did that last time, and that was really good. <laughs> Make the bruise custom character in WWE, that way I can finish him off in the ring. Oh, you're an idea man, Trappy. You will go far in this organization, and I didn't even have to break your mind with ghost powers. You will you will go far, sir. There's a lot of characters I want to make in WWE. In fact, I had a whole thing there. It would take a lot of time and effort. I'm wishing other fans would do it for me. I wanted to make all the members of the weekly pull make a weekly pull championship and then have us all fight for it in like a big battle royale. 
And then, you know, I could take a bunch of time painstakingly making, uh, what is it, all the entrances. Alright, what do we got? The old strains is feeble mind plotting and <laughs> Let us make things simpler for him. His feeble mind. Wow, that's harsh, Calibrimpor. <laughs> He's so feeble in the mind after we broke him. <laughs> Uh, I'm imagining that's him over there. Oh, who the fuck are you? Scott. Scott Goldfang, you just happen to be hanging out here on top? I should probably finish you off, Scoff, because you'll only be trouble for me later if I don't. Alright, you gonna introduce yourself? Get no more. Hello, Travis Williams again. You just look cool. And again, and the Marauders are my favorite tribe, so I'll never pass up the opportunity to have a Marauder in my ranks. You stay and fight for me. You sure can, Scoth. I was actually looking for someone. Which direction was I going? Baga. Baga the Stewer. There. There's the one I wanted. Man, he's he's pretty well protected by dudes. Honestly, I'm surprised. God, I love being able to stop myself from falling with more acts of murder. No, they're not even fighting each other. They're totally hanging out. Yeah, I taint's afraid though. Talion ain't so scared of nothing. Uh, where am I? Yeah. Oh, that's sad. I would never try to take the food. Would you just keep the bloody food? Wow, I did a I did a number on this guy. And he's arrow proof, of course he is. That's fine, these guys aren't arrow proof. Yeah, you can run away. You're not the one I want. It's not over until the fat Olog sings, I'm afraid. And that means you. Nice, ni nice view of your ass back here. <laughs> he didn't even run away. The fire is spreading so hard he died. Oh, I I'm gonna take the fort. I'm gonna take whatever I want all day, every day. Because that's what you do when you're the Bright Lord. Who the fuck are you? Betrayed you. Ah. And I'll gladly do it again. But I think a better idea. Was that guy your blood brother? You right now. And be done with it. <laughs> can you can you come back in like 20 minutes, Pug? I'll, I'll deal with you later. There we go. It's your fault. Yeah. Oh god damn it, he's death defying motherfucker. Not the one I want. You take your poison, you be gone. You're not the one I want. 
Uh, with a weird slowdown there. Almost got him. Oh, Jesus, he fucked me up there. There we go. Sure is, buddy. See you on the other side. Oh, I just chopped his arm off. He could actually come back from that. They're only really dead if you cut off their heads. They're only truly dead if you cut off the heads. Nah, I'm, I, I, I'm good, bro. I'm good. I will deal with you later, sir. Gimme, gi gimme, 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 gimme. I guess I'll finish you off now. I mean, again, can't can't let any traders trade. Oh god, he's quick timing me. Oh shit. I am unstoppable, I feel it. I will kill some of you guys to up my thing. I guess I had too many dudes on my side, so it was only a matter of time till one of them traitored. God damn it, still no arrows. Uh, I guess. Oh, he's got his little knifey knives. Oh, you fucking archer. Are you dead yet? I suppose you're still sore over my I dream. am. Good. Now stay dead like a good betrayer. Now well, that guy lost an arm too. So there's a chance that guy could come back with like a limb or as a zombie or something. Cuz I only cut off his head. Ooh, he dropped a pretty good Gondorian dagger, too. You mother... I'm gonna get up there, I'm gonna finish you off. And then I'm gonna check my gear. Ooh, ooh. Actually, hey, for all that damage you did, I'm gonna suck out your brain. Good. Now it's my brain. Alright, let's actually see what we got going on here. 